Well, actually, I saw in the paper in Austin they were having like a little, you know, vintage warplane demo and you could fly in them. So I thought that would be a cool little thing to go over and check them out. Because Patrick and Bob don't really have that much experience riveting. They've seen it, but it's kind of cool to like, we just lucked out to like see the stuff the morning we're going to start doing it. We've come over here today to uh, look at these airplanes. They're old World War II bombers. The B-17 in particular is, uh, is kind of one of the more famous ones. And the seats we're making today, we're going to try to emulate those to an extent. Um, so it's, it's just a good opportunity to see them first. Yeah, we're just looking today, looking for inspiration. Lots of rivets. I think I would have been well more adjusted growing up in the 30s or 40s. I'd have been irrelevant. No one would have thought I was like, you know, a metalworking hero or something like that because I'd just do a job that, that, that thousands of people did. You know, women were doing while the men were away at war. Women were riveting planes together. 